Yeah, I got in a few games early in the season on special teams. Never got a chance to get out of, uh, on defense, but I mean, it was a huge learning curve for me. I, I still enjoyed the season. Did you play against Notre Dame? Yeah, I played a few snaps on special teams and uh, punt return. Gotcha. Okay. So uh, you, you always hear guys that are as highly recruited as you say when you know they come in as what like first of all what was your expectation of playing time wide as a freshman? Uh, for me I mean I didn't really have high expectations of playing. I just really wanted to come in and get acclimated with the weather, the new coaches, I mean the whole facility, being away from home and all that stuff. So playing time that was just something that I felt like if I earned it it'll come to me. Right. As long as I get everything down, get the plays and everything, I knew the playbook would be the biggest thing for me. So I knew once I got that down then I would get a chance to get a chance to go out there and get a chance to play on the field. How far was it into the season that you started to feel like all right I kinda understand how I fit in this. Uh, to be honest, it, it's towards the end of the season. I was still a little bit confused. I mean, really? I never really got the, the whole scheme down. So this year when Coach Steele got here and we got a chance to go over some of the new stuff and things like that, it was it kind of started clicking to me. I felt like I got a chance to really get a chance to sit down and actually look at it and understand it more. It's kind of like, oh, man, I just learned this stuff and now I got to scrap some of that and start, start over again? Uh, kind of. I mean, the real big thing with that was just the terminology, just mm -hmm. the new terms and the stuff like that. But for the most part, a lot of the schemes kind of based off of the same thing. But it's definitely some new stuff in there. But it was really the terminology that I had to get down. Have you worked at either of the outside spots? No, I haven't worked on the outside yet. Did you do that last year at the even? No, sir. So you've been a Mike all along. Yes, sir. 100%. Yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead, the, the heat last year, uh, that, that got you in a little bit? Uh, you weren't well, quite ready for that? I mean, I wouldn't really say it was the heat. It was just I came in, I didn't get a chance to do a lot of running during the offseason mm -hmm. and everything because I had the so shoulder surgery in January. Oh. So I couldn't really, I was definitely out of shape when I got here. So the heat definitely didn't add any, uh, any, <laughs> any positive things to that. So, mm -hmm. I mean, that was just adding on to me being out of shape and then I was a little bit overweight and everything. So I just had to get used to all that. But once I got in shape and got, the, got my weight down and everything, like now this, this is beautiful for me. I love it. So it's what my new now. What did they repair in your shoulder? What was the surgery for? It was my labrum. Labrum, and that was from a high school injury? Yeah. So you played the season with it? Yeah, uh, I played two years with it actually and didn't know it was torn. So I wow. had no idea, but I got that all fixed. I'm having no problems with it now. I'm feeling great. Mm -hmm. They check you out though. They keep an eye on it to make sure you're not having. Well, I mean, if I'm not having any problems with it or anything, yeah. then I'm fine. I mean, we're not trying to baby it or anything like that. I'm in the weight room, just getting it stronger and everything like that, and I'm I'm feeling amazing right now.